this so i came across this um, post yesterday or even day before yesterday about um hakimi ashraf hakimi he plays for psg and he's also played for the moroccan international team him and mbappe are very close friends but let me just read what he says he says ashraf hakimi wife had taken the court let me not even read let me just explain to you guys so his wife basically filed for divorce and she wanted half of all his assets wanted half of all what he had but the court found out that he doesn't have anything all the stuff that she thought he had was under his mother's name so because of that she's not able to collect anything from him and that's mad because that's gotten the whole internet buzzing trending some people are praising him that he's smart some people some women have come from girls ladies calling him mommy's boy making like making fun of him you know a lot of women they don't like mommy's boy but being a mommy's boy has actually paid off for him like <laughs> he, he, he's smart man like for me i don't know the dynamic between his both both of them i don't know like maybe all the stuff he because i think they've only been together for like two years two three years so i'm sure all the stuff he he got all his asset all everything he definitely got it before her like most likely for sure he's a footballer and how much money they earn is crazy so he got them before her so he's thinking you come into my life you came into my life when i'm already up there i'm not gonna make a mistake for me to lose everything and i think there was something that i read he said that obviously his mom went through a lot sacrificed a lot deprived him and his siblings of things so that they can push him to get to where he is today and he's not gonna let anything go wrong or lose everything that they've worked hard for so he puts everything under his mom's name to protect her and which i think is fair to be honest then maybe if there's other stuff that him and his wife achieved together she contributed and they both achieved them together then i can understand okay she can take half he can take half but for things that he has acquired before they met each other or got together or even his mom or his family sweat to to put money into for them to achieve he, he has the right to do what he has the right to do what he did and he's smart for doing that and also like people change people actually change like one minute people actually change yeah the only person i think that can't really change so as you obviously anyone can change but it's like your mom is blood and like the love your mom will have for you no one can surpass that love like even if it's your wife because you're married obviously maybe you do church wedding you're married through god married through the court but nowadays the way they promote divorce the way they encourage divorce it's like it's such a business like the government to benefit from divorce they'll break your home like <laughs> there's so many things there whereas if it's family family is family maybe this even I'm, I'm even saying that maybe if they didn't want to do a divorce like an official divorce they just kept low-key i want to separate maybe they come to a conclusion you take this i take this that would have even be better as well but i'm sure he, he for me i don't think he'll be that type of guy to leave his wife to suffer especially i think they have children as well so i don't think he would be that type of guy unless maybe she did him so wrong and let's just try read some more tweets i'm trying to go to some more tweets it's <laughs> so, so some funny one they say the crazy part is some ladies want a son like akimi but not a husband like akimi you see that's the truth some people they want your son to be close to the mom but then if it's another guy you're calling him mommy's boy like honestly but then uh man so let me read it say hakimi being a mommy's boy paid off this is insane this was in the um was it the world cup they had last was it last year i can't even remember it was the world cup see his mom there you can see now people now understand this picture 
Aquí mismo en mi poeta y doble mi mismo convencer. Aquí mismo en el pies de salary convencer. <laughs> oh my days, I wish I could see the look on his white face after the news. <laughs> oh man, this is social media is funny. Oh yeah, the Ebuwe situation. You guys, I don't know if you guys heard that time when I think Ebuwe's wife divorced him. She took everything. He was back to being broke. Like, honestly, because at the end of the day, let's be truthful. There's, they say there's, there's supposed to be love, but when things happen, like especially, because relationship can be ups and down. People can change. So. That love, what was it built on in the first place? Like, because when certain things just no longer going so well, people start insulting each other, saying negative things about each other. The love is out of the window. Like, the marriage can just be broken down. So many things. Uh, let's carry on reading some tweets. Say Ashraf Hakimi and his one after winning. <laughs> That's actually him and his mom, bro. the same news uh, and yeah this is another video let's just wrap it up now what do you guys think so comment down below <laughs> oh this is the from the time when he went to greet his mom that's the picture <laughs> So nice, man. That's so cute. So cute. But yeah, what do you guys think? Though? <laughs> There's so many funny tweets. Hakimi and Mbappe looking for mom to accept transaction, pay for their bill. <laughs> so uh, Mbappe probably doing the same thing. Stuff is under his mom's name. Mbappe. But there was one thing I just wanted to find out. Yeah. No, let me read this first. It says Hakimi with headphones saying it with like Mbappe. Mbappe says to him, Bro, you get money, yo. You they use Airpod Max. Hakimi replies, It's my mom that bought it for me, yo. <laughs> Social media, yeah, so funny. But there's one thing I wanted to know, yeah. Let's say you put all your stuff under your mom's name, yeah. And she passes away before you. What happens? Or will she write a will to say that to put everything back under your name? Is that how it works? Somebody comment down below. Like, share, subscribe. See you in the next video. Peace.